Okay, sometimes no words are necessary. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive trying out something new from Burger King and it's making me angry. That's right. The angriest Whopper is here. I got everything on this except tomato. So anything that is making this angry, all the angry accoutrement, is still on this bad boy. The jalapenos, the angry onion petals, the angry sauce, the angry bun. Insert anything else angry you like. But this is the angriest Whopper. So we're gonna get right into this. The angry, angry, angry. Look at this. There we go. Angriest Whopper, 86 the tomato. Right there. So let's open this up. All right, welcome back. You got a close up of this red bun of goodness here. So this, like I said, is the angriest Whopper. Get you right up there and you see everything I explain. I did forget bacon. It doesn't say if the bacon was angry or not, but I'm guessing it is since it's in the middle of all this other hot stuff. So look at that, upside down, the more you turn me inside out. All right, one final note before I try this. I'm not a huge fan of hot. I like spice. I like a little heat. And I have only had jalapeno on one thing in my life. So we're gonna get right into this. Angry everything, red bun, angry sauce dripping, wish me luck. And I'm going right into this little bite right here. And it won't be little. There's mayonnaise on this too. Ooh, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Wow. Okay. All right. Wow. Right off Jump Street, I'm going to tell you that that sauce exploding on my taste buds, that's what she said, is amazing. Wow. And I don't know if it's mixing in with the mayonnaise as well, giving it a little taste. But there is some heat building. Take a look in there. Yeah. Ooh, little heat, little heat. Let's go one more bite here, right on this angry onion petal. Hmm. Hmm. Wow. The bun is nice and soft, even though it is red, Alabama crimson red. And rumor has it there is some heat infused in the bun as well. Um, we will see about that. But I'm going to go for one more bite right in the middle because I see a jalapeno peeking out. And I know I must have gotten one because uh, I'm starting to sweat just a little bit. It's got a little bit of heat. So one more bite. Okay. Mm. Okay, Burger King. Well played, well played. Now as I'm talking here, the heat is building, but I'm gonna tell you there's a lot going on in this uh, burger and everything does work for me. Everything seemed fresh, even the lettuce, the cheese I could even taste in there, and that sauce to me just put it over the top, at least for me. As soon as I took that first bite, I'm like, whoa, what is this dancing on my taste buds? Angry sauce, but man, that is good. Bun is soft. All the ingredients seem fresh. I did have to wait about 10 minutes for this. They were backed up at Burger King. Man, everything really works well. And as for the heat factor, I'm going to say it's about a four. And I took three healthy bites. I know I got jalapeno, a big chunk of it in that last one, and a little bit in the second one. But nothing where if you like, oh, I don't like hot. I don't think it's that hot where it's going to turn you off. So... I'm a fan of everything here, and, and obviously the gimmick of the red bun is going to gravitate people to it, you know, angriest Whopper. But at the beginning of this, I was angry. Now, not so much. 
So let's rate this, shall we? On a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, $5.69, and 100 meaning the promised land of, uh, I'm going to give the new Angriest Whopper Red Bun Concoction a rating of... Ninety. Nine out of ten for all you keeping score at home. Perfect size and everything, like I said, inside this burger just worked. There's a lot going on too. Now don't get thrown mentally with the red bun. It's a nice soft bun. And let me see if it is infused with anything. All right. Yeah, it's a little something extra in the bun as well. It has a little spice to it, but definitely clearing up my sinuses, but not overly hot. I am a fan of this, which is saying a lot. I'm not a huge Burger King aficionado, but this works on every level. I think it's a definite hit. So what do you want from me? Another review in the books. Please like, please comment, and please subscribe. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter, and we will see you soon with some more reviews. Bye.